Heard. Mr. John Quarterman. Please state your name and the address for the record, please. All righty. I want to be sure I turned it in early enough this time, <laughs> which would be yesterday. I'm uh, John Quarterman. I live at 6565 Quarterman Road. You want the postal address to? I'm sorry, say that again. I live, uh, uh, do you want my postal address too, or is my residence? Whatever you have right here. All right. <laughs> well, my postal address is 3338 Country Club Road, PMB 336. Okay, that'll be fine. All right. So, um, embarrassing as it is, I'm here to compliment a whole bunch of people and invite you to a few events. <laughs> I'm going to start with one who's not on the letter that I handed you yesterday, which is Steve Stalvey and utilities for actually upgrading a water main and the commissioners for approving that before it breaks. <laughs> I like that. Um, and uh, congratulations to engineering, particularly Pro Chad McLeod, and to the commissioners, particularly Joyce Evans and Marcus Marshall, for the boat ramp. It's finally almost finished. Looking forward to it. And people have already been using that park, which you bought several years ago. Thanks for that. Um, so several years ago, Chairman, uh, when uh, we talked about uh, the boat ramp, I mentioned that we have, by we, I mean Walls Watershed Coalition, that we have a draft resolution in support of the Alapaha River Water Trail. And I believe at the time you said you prefer to wait till the ribbon cutting for the boat ramp. So I'm bringing this back up. This is very similar to the version you saw before. It just has tacked on to the end of the whereas is that the boat ramp is completed, which I assume at the time it's signed would be true. Okay, and we also, well, let's not get ahead of myself here. Coming up in June, there's a thing called Paddle Georgia. Every year, the uh, this outfit picks a river and paddles down it. This year, they picked our with the Coochie River. They paddle for seven days. So they're going to have to make a right at Swanee and keep going. They're going to get out between Mayo and Louisville. But they're starting at Troopville Boat Ramp. So I'd like to invite all of you to come down. You don't even have to paddle. You can sit at our tent there at the confluence and watch all the paddlers paddle by. Or if you do want to paddle, if you want just one day, June 17th is professional day. So that would be uh, elected officials get in free. Other people pay 30 bucks. Um, so, uh, doo -doo 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 -doo. and there is another water trail resolution for the with the Coochie and Little River water trail, which didn't even exist when we first started talking about the Alapa River water trail. Similar idea. This one specifically mentions that the signs, the road signs being made by public service, pu public works, thank you, Robin Cumbus, uh, probably will mostly be in place by the time that uh, the uh, Paddle Georgia comes by, which will be great advertising for Lowndes County because they're going to be getting in and getting out at these landings, so they will see those signs. And uh, we have a Swanee River Keeper songwriting contest coming up August 24th. Y'all look like songwriters to me. <laughs> so I know you'll submit something or at least come watch. And we have a... A new sponsor this year, our top-level sponsor is Georgia Beer Company. If you haven't been there, I recommend them. Finally, uh, we have the Walls Boomerang Paddle Race, our other paddle race, October 26, starting at the state line ramp, paddling into Florida and back. So uh, you may want to come uh, deal with that. Uh, maybe you want to paddle, or maybe someone would like to welcome the paddlers back to the state of Georgia and the county of Lowndes. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks, John. Commissioners, any comments? Hearing none, I'll entertain a motion to adjourn. Motion to adjourn. Second.